All right, welcome back. Let's see. Uh, last time we actually ran back to Barrow Ghost uh, to pick up some more equipment. And uh, we checked out the old cast of runes, found out that they actually descend into a dungeon. So because of that, we came back here to Gullikin. We're actually going to go to Firewine Bridge um, in the hopes of training up now just Monteron. Um, Zar actually leveled up last episode, <laughs> so now he's a level 2 necromancer. Um, I mean, if we can get him even higher, that would be great, but uh, we'll see. Okay. So, as I said, we have, I think we have three options Fine. on how to approach the Firewine Kobold problem. As I said, there's a secret entrance in the basement of the temple slash winery. There's, uh, Jenkel's basement has what we're assuming to be some secret access point for the Kobolds. Or via the world map. So I think we're gonna approach it from here at the world map, because, uh, again, it gives us the most options of how to approach it, really. <laughs> we can scout it more easily and uh, just kind of poke around. Okay. A simple matter. Yeah, so still a barren landscape like the uh, highlands, I guess, of uh, Oldcaster. See, like a cactus here or there. I'm not even sure exactly what we're looking for, except, <laughs> I guess, kobolds. Here's a road marker. Okay, Firewine Bridge. Oh, who's this? Benton. Just kind of standing here. It's actually late in the day. I think we'll talk to him. Maybe uh, camp here. What? A Bye, simple friend. matter. He's saying he's a devout follower of the great, as he puts it, great broken Ilmater. He's wondering if we follow the path of the Crying God. Uh, I actually don't know what the, who, if, uh, well, certainly not Bronwyn. I think that's, as far as Lily knows, that's the only one who worships any god, and that would be Tempest, so... She's not gonna lie to him, just none of us worship Ilmater. <laughs> He's saying we must rectify this at once. Listen closely while I tell you the wonders that will come once you have converted to Ilmater's faith. It looks like he's giving us a bit of a sermon here. Okay, he's saying, uh, just trying to summarize if I can. Once you have suffered in the service of Ilmater, you w will have your eyes open to the evils of the world. And I guess at the end here, a slight insult towards uh, spellcasters is saying, um, or citing magic as wicked powers that are wielded by sorcerers. So I think Lily is going to interject here and say that, uh, careful, <laughs> careful what you say, really. He's saying magic only leads to pain and misery. It's a wicked art, I tell you. He's going to continue his sermon here. I 
He's asking if we'll cast off our possessions and become faithful of Ilmater. <laughs> yeah, Lily's uh, gonna try to just dismiss him here, saying we have better things to do than stand here and listen to him. He's saying that it's obvious that we're, our minds are clouded by the numerous vices all of us must be engaging in. I pity the whole lot of you. Goodbye. Okay. That was, uh, interesting. Yeah, I think we're gonna camp just because we'd rather explore during the day, I think. I actually really don't know if it makes a difference, but, uh... Just seems to make sense. To me, at least. <laughs> and... Okay. Must be maybe very early. Yeah, okay. So it's just before sunrise, but that's okay. Yes? For a minute there with the priest, I thought maybe uh, he was <laughs> some kind of a con artist trying to get us to shed our earthly possessions, <laughs> meaning he was going to try to rob us, but I guess not. Maybe he was being sincere. Alright, looks like coming to the edge of a cliff here. Deep uh, ravine, I guess. Eh, it almost looks like uh, a skeleton here, embedded in the ground. Huh. Some cactus. Don't really have a plan. I guess we'll hug this uh, ravine. Well, they did say that the one thing that was remaining was the bridge from from the town of Firewine, so I guess we should at least expect to find that. And... Well, we don't know. Some kind of structure. Can't really tell what it is. Continues up there, okay. Some remnant of the town of Farwein. At least when you look at it from this perspective, maybe this is the bridge, actually. <laughs> if you look at it, it looks like support structures here on either side that we're skirting. Okay. That's probably what it is. Just hope we can uh, get around. 